What's up you guys? Welcome back. So today we have a mini fashion fall haul and I'm so excited because this entire wardrobe is going to be worn on my trip to Salem. I've never been to Salem or the Upper East Coast for that matter. So I put together my outfits that I'll be wearing and I thought it'd be fun to share with you guys. Now if you already follow me, you know that my wardrobe is pretty minimalistic in colors. It's usually black mixed in with a little bit of earth tones. Black is honestly one of my favorite colors to wear, so I can't help. I like what I like, and I'm a creature of habit. But I thought it would be fun to share with you guys what I'll be wearing. So let's just jump into it. So for my first outfit, I'm going to be pairing this bodysuit that I got from Pretty Little Thing. It's a very comfortable rib material. It's not one of those ribs materials where they stretch over time and they're uncomfortable. This is going to still stay fit to the body. And then one of my absolute favorite finds, I got this faux leather skirt from Akira. Just wait till you hear the price. This went from $36 to the $5 rack. I had to snag it. Super comfortable, love the little zipper detail. And of course, with an all blacked out outfit, I have to wear tights. So keeping those super blacked out, I got these from Target. I think that they are a 120. So um, pretty much as dark as it's gonna get. This is either 120 or 80 actually, I'm sorry. I think it might be 80. And when I say 80, I mean the opacity. So. Um, not much light's gonna get through those. Then I'm gonna pair them with these faux leather boots that I got from Target. I'm so obsessed with these. I think this is my favorite shoe find that I've ever had. I'm a lover of the combat boot plus heels. So this was a win-win to me. Now if you wanted to break it up a little bit or it's a little bit chillier out, I do have this long, what do we call these, trench coats. You know, I'm really not that great at fashion, but uh, I know how to make it look good. So I got this from Fashion Nova. It is a beige camel color. Just pair that with it and your outfit is complete. Next, we have an oversized sweater that I also got from Pretty Little Thing. This thing is so comfy, so warm, and it has these nice little slits down the side of them because they do go past the hip area and the butt area. And I'll be pairing them with these faux leather leggings that I got from Windsor so comfy and they're lined so they're it's not too warm to wear them but they're super comfy and they definitely do keep you warm for accessories i thought it'd be fun to pair it with this little fanny pack purse this i actually got from my best friend which i have to talk about what she does because it's absolutely amazing she came out with her company it's called thrifty box and she's basically your personal shopper at the thrift store so there's certain box prices that you can purchase from she also purchases items and leaves them up for auction if you wanted to just maybe buy one thing but you can buy say a 20 30 40 dollar box and you get a certain amount of items in there you fill out a questionnaire and she shops for you and this is one of the things that she got for me and I'm obsessed with it I she hit it right on the mark with my questionnaire so this I got from the thrift store all the way in Arizona. For shoes, I'll probably stick with the same faux leather boot just to kind of give that illusion all the way down to the feet. Now, I don't know about you guys, but my absolute favorite outfits to wear are just anything comfy and baggy. So we needed a comfy day outfit. So these pants I got from Windsor. Windsor, Akira, Pretty Little Thing, those are majority of where I shop from. Oh, and Target. Those are like my favorite places to get all my outfits from. So these are from Windsor, just a nice baggy holy jean. And then I thought it would be nice just to pair it with an oversized sweater. This is just a black sweater from Pretty Little Thing. I absolutely love their oversized sweaters. They are so, so comfy, great material. And then for this outfit, I thought it'd be really cute to pair it with a little backpack that I got from Target. What's really cool about this though is it can interchange. You just take the straps off and you could stick them to the side and then you have a crossbody purse. So absolutely love the versatility of this backpack just to get a little bit more options out of a purse. And for shoes, I'm going to be pairing it with one of my favorite pairs of Jordans that I own and it is the Jordan 11 Aris. I love the gold detail, the all black with the white and the just fake little glitter that's around the shoe. My absolute favorite. I get so many compliments when I wear them and I think that this would be a perfect pair for this outfit. Plus it kind of matches the purse. So 
super cute and comfy. Now I can't just have one comfy outfit, I have to have multiple, so we have another one coming at you. So these are very similar to the ones that I got from Windsor, but these are from Akira, just another nice holy jean, but these ones are gonna be a little bit more fitted, so it's not as baggy as the first ones. And then I'm just gonna pair it with this white long sleeve top that I got from Target. I like that it's a little cropped, so adds to like a baggy 90s boy look. And then I'm gonna pair it with this black denim jacket that I got from Pretty Little Thing. Now what I love about this jacket, I like denim jackets, but sometimes they can be too stiff and that's just not my thing. I like to be comfortable. So wearing denim across my body is not comfortable to me, but this material is a lot lighter, but it's still thick where it's gonna keep you warm, but it's just more movable and more breathable. So absolutely in love with that. And then just to maybe give a little bit of pop of color or if it's cold out that day, um, I have this really nice like terracotta color scarf that I got from Old Navy. Super warm, fall friendly and cute. And for shoes, I will be pairing it with this cute little combat boot that I got from DSW actually. Super cute, love the little boy look. It'll kind of just pull that whole 90s bad boy look, but you know, girl version. Last but not least, are any of you guys a fan of Kim Possible? Because I definitely take a lot of her fashion advice. I'm obsessed with cargo pants. I absolutely love them. I have every color and I keep buying more and more for no reason, but I just love them. So I got these olive cargo pants that I got from Windsor. Super, super cute. Uh, it has that little buckle. Now let me tell you, this makes your butt look phenom. So of course, to pair it, I'm gonna use this really tight black ribbed top that I got from Windsor as well. I really like pairing cargo pants with something super tight on top. I feel like it gives, you know, just a little bit more shape to you since the pants tend to be a little bit more baggy. But these pants out of all my cargo pants definitely fit a little bit more fitted, so you know, works out. The only thing with this outfit is I don't know if I'm gonna pair it with anything else and I don't even know what shoes I'm gonna pair it with. So that's still on my mind. I mean, you can wear any type of shoes with this. I do have another combat boot, but I feel like if I wore those, it would look a little bit military and I wanna be more fashionable, not military. But either way, super cute look and I love it. But that's it for my little mini fashion haul. Who knows, I might even add more to this wardrobe because I'm an overpacker and I just get anxiety because I don't know how I'm gonna feel that day. The weather can be different, my mood can be different, we know how that goes. As long as I can still find these items on their website, I will absolutely link them down below for you guys. But that's it for this video, I hope you like it. If you wanna see more fashion hauls or more outfits or ideas for vacations, just give this video a big thumbs up and also comment down below what you'd like to see next. Do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe to all my videos if you'd like to see more. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, my name is Amanda Devon on there as well. And you'll be able to see all my outfits on there. So until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye.